Who are the Native American Yanomami in Brazil? The Yanomami are a group of nearly 35,000 Native Americans who live in about 200 to 215 villages in the Amazon rainforest on the border between Venezuela and Brazil. All speakers of the same language family called Yanomami. The first report of the Yanomami in the European world is from 1645, when a Salvadoran expedition commanded by Apolinar Diaz de la Fuente visited some Yekons who lived on the Pandamo River. In the state of Roraima, Brazil, during the 17th, development projects were implemented by the military politicians during the Brazilian civil military dictatorship at the time. A road was built on land where the Yanomami lived and various colonization programs implemented. In the same period, military politicians detected important mineral deposits in the region, starting the first gold rush in Yanomami's land. The Yanomami Native American land was officially demarcated in 1991 and ratified in 1992 by the President of Brazil, Fernando Collor, thus ensuring the Yanomami people the constitutional right to the exclusive use of a large territory located in the states of Roraima and Amazonas. During the government of the military politician Jair Messias Bolsonaro between 2018 and 2022, the government project that implemented was the forced integration or extinction of Native America. The signs of malnourished Yanomami men, women and children with the bones on the entire body showing portrayal the success of the project. Malnutrition and the hunger are a direct consequence of the occupation of their territories by illegal prospectors. Mining in the region blocked the Yanomami people for carrying out their basic productive activities. There are indications of the actions of military politicians throughout the tragedy experienced by the Yanomami. Former Vice President Hamilton Mourão chaired the National Council for the Legal Amazon for three years. These military politicians chose 19 military politicians for this council. In 2023, after requests from the Minister of Justice and the Public Security, Flavio Dino, the federal police opened an inquiry to investigate whether there was a crime of genocide and omission of assistance by the Bolsonaro government to the Yanomami. Violence against Yanomami communities has also increased since the Ministry of Justice closed the airspace on February. A decree allows the federal government to neutralize aircraft and equipment related to mining illegal. Therefore, the Native American Yanomami in Brazil are today fighting against the vanish caused by illegal mining and the policy applied by the government of military politicians. There is also a video game called Inter Estrelas that is becoming a developer and tells the story of the Yanomami struggle against illegal mining. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like this video, subscribe to the channel and write a comment saying where are you from. See you later.